Hey, this is Charles 9mm, and we've got a great product to show you today. Uh, I'm here with the Rambling Chronic PK, who's going to help me do this review. This is something that's near and dear to our heart, because we're both runners. And what we're going to be looking today at today is the fuel belt. A fuel belt is really more a, a hydration system, a nutrition system. This one is a, a belt. This is, uh, I just have it sitting on my leg here. Uh, this is a the Revenge Series belt. And has these two small bottles. I believe these are, aren't these seven ounces? I believe they're seven no, ounces. They're actually eight ounces. Eight ounces? Believe, yeah. And uh, they, uh, so rather than carrying one big water bottle like we both have done before, uh, we have gone to these smaller bottles that distribute the weight. Uh, I'll show you mine first, then we'll take a look at uh, uh, Rambling PK, uh, Rambling Chronic PKs over here and uh, get kind of his opinion as well. This one, uh, is uh, the Revenge series made by Fuel Belt, and it has a Velcro latch in the front, which is nice. So there's no buckles to bother you right in the front here. It's got two adjustment buckles on either side, which you can quickly adjust to tighten or loosen. It's got this foam padded um, <coughs> elastic here. This is actually the elastic which they've been, they've put this foam over. I can get you see if you can see it, and it's quite vented. And the little bottles pop into these little plastic holsters. Now when you're running they pop off very easily. Uh, you can you pop these open with your teeth, drink the contents whether this is a uh, some kind of hydration um, fluid, Gatorade, uh, coconut water which is Rambling uh, Chronic PK's favorite or just plain water. And uh, there you have it, just a little bottle pops right back in the little holster. Uh, much easier to do when you're actually wearing it than having it sit on your leg. Uh, really nice. Um, Rambling Chronic PK, show me what you have. Okay, this is this is my fuel belt, and you can see I've got four bottles. Um, up to this point, before I got this belt, I had one large bottle that I wore in my back, and it actually fit right in the the spine area of my back. And what would happen is, is as I would run, it would make an up and down movement and the, the contents of that water would kind of smack me around a little bit uh, and it was very difficult to reach around and get it. This works out for me because I have a I have a routine in which prior to the race I like to have some electrolytes that I put in one bottle uh, and I also like to have another that I take right after the race uh, so that I can uh, kind of bounce back quicker. And you use a little uh, coconut water? Uh, on the front, as I'm running coconut water, and it, it really becomes my source. I don't actually plan on or have carry just plain water. Uh, I, I, I like that water to add value as I run. Now afterwards, after the race, of course, I might pound the, the heck out of some water, but, but while I'm in the race, I want something like coconut water that gives me uh, more of an instant jolt. So I'll have these two containers filled up with coconut water uh, so I can reach in from the front and pull them out very quickly. And then, of course, we've got a nice little pouch here, which I, I keep my key in. Uh, to right. my vehicle. And the, re the Revenge also, the two bottler that I have also has the little pouch which I find very convenient and uh, not to not to cut you off there but I keep uh, a little uh, jackknife under here because you never know when you have to you know cut clothing for a bandage or something like that and uh, so I believe a little pocket knife uh, right behind there. So that's just a little adaptation I've done. Go ahead. Well when I look at the the way this thing comes and and hits me this actually is a fitted unit so this is this is size medium which is which fits me perfectly around the around the waist so it velcros together it's got it's made of elastic uh, so that it stretches with me and it holds tight to me um, the uh, things here I have considered during the practice run I can pull out and you can see how this really doesn't have any space to it so there's no real weight in the elastic and I can run the race or the practice race uh, or, or just my just my long run for example uh, and have less weight and take those two bottles out and then it would emulate what Charles 9 millimeter has uh, so it depends on how I feel that day and what I, what contents I need whether I need the four bottle or whether I need the two bottle Really, if you're going to do a really long distance run, 
The, uh, the Revenge is a good choice because you have so much water you can carry. The Revenge, on the other hand, only has two bottles, which is excellent uh, for somebody who's going to, doesn't need quite as much hydration, maybe not going to go that much short distance, or maybe maybe to carry during a, you know, like a half marathon or something right. like that. Yeah. So in all, all in all, you'd recommend the, 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 uh, the fuel belt? Well, I personally have adapted to this, having used other people's products, uh, even even some very good products that, that other companies have, this one just seems to emulate the weight that I need in the way that I need it. And I would echo that as well. I'm, I really like the fuel the fuel belt. I think one, one thing I want to notice too is the quality of the fuel belt. It's well made. The stitches are very good. The bottle's nice and durable. Uh, that's, uh, the caps here are rubber, so it's not going to hurt your teeth when you pull them open with your teeth, because we all pull them open with our teeth, don't we? Oh, yes, sir. And uh, they have the foam on the inside is of excellent quality. Um, yeah, we're looking at the, the, the four, the four uh, bottle and the, uh, the new Revenge series. I think we really like them, don't you? I do. Finally, there's one thing that I really uh, have noticed with this is that this thing absorbs some of the sweat. You know, typically, if you have a belt wrapped around you, that's a source of uh, sweat adapting to that particular point because it doesn't have anywhere to go. And, and, and this area right here, of course, the, the water can then filter into the foam and kind of release itself. Uh, so that that's just kind of an added benefit. Yeah, I, wanted I, know, to point I noticed out. that as well. It didn't feel real sweaty. It kind of evaporated out. So I think that's where those holes are there. Well, what's our final analysis? I love it. A plus, love right? It. Yes. Sir. All right. Well, that's uh, Charles Nine Millimeter and uh, the Chronic uh, Rambling Chronic PK signing off, and we're going to give Fuel Belt an A plus. Thank you. Bye bye.